Hello my friends. Today's video is called Sticking to Your Plan. And sometimes that can be difficult if we don't write our plan down. So first of all, put your plan in your planner. Then look at it at night before the, it actually happens and in the morning before it actually happens. That's going to help you a lot. Um, but one of the things I'm going to add to that is to do something that physically gives you the idea that you're going to be working. So in the Fly Lady system, she says, put your shoes on. Now, I'm a Florida girl. I'm a barefoot girl. So putting my shoes on doesn't give me the feeling that I'm going to work. It just makes me claustrophobic. But I'll tell you what does help me, and that's an apron. When I put an apron on, it's like putting on a uniform saying, okay, this is my time that I'm going to be working. I'm not playing during this time. I'm not watching television with my apron on. I'm wearing my apron to work. So that brings me to something very exciting. My friend Denise sent me an apron. And I'm going to open it up right now. Denise um, has a company called Apron Diva. Her name is Denise Jordan. Her, what, her YouTube channel is This and That with Denise Jordan. But her company is Aprons Diva. So I will Apron Diva. So I will put a link for you down below. But I want to show you what she sent me and put it on and just show you what it looks like. And then we'll talk about wearing an apron a little bit more. So I'm opening it right now. I haven't seen it yet. I'm very excited. Okay, oh, so cute. Here's what's in here. And she's got a little cloak that she sends too. So let me open the plastic now. Actually, I think there's just, how do we get into this? I'm just going to cut it open. I'm sure there's a better way, but you know me. Okay, so first, what a pretty pattern. First, She's put in here, very professional, her calling card, her business card. And secondly, you have permission to take care of yourself. That's her quote. The purpose of the apron notes are to remind each of you homemakers how special you really are. It is my hope that you'll think of this message as a note of encouragement from your dearest friend. So when you buy an apron, she gives you a special note. You have permission to take care of yourself. That's mine. And then she's written me a special little note. Oh, okay, so let's see what she sent me. Oh, this is tissue paper. She really goes above and beyond. And here is the apron. Oh my goodness, look at this. How perfect for this time of year for me. Nice, vibrant colors. In fact, I'm gonna try it on for you. So let's, let's move this around and I'll put it on for you. Let's see? So over the head, I love that. Makes it nice and easy. And then it ties behind. Or you could tie it in front if you were especially small. I'm not especially small, so I'll just tie it behind. But this is the apron. Hang on, I'm tying it. So fun. Okay, so this is the apron. Let me back up so you can see. Isn't that cute? It's a nice long apron. The other good thing about an apron is, number one, this has pockets. So as you're walking around, you can put things in your pockets. You can use an apron to gather things up, to carry laundry, to pick up when you're doing your clutter checks, make it into a little pocket. Aprons are fabulous, and the other thing they do is they prevent you from getting food or cleaning products on your clothes. So this is what I want you to do. I want you to get an apron. If you'd like, you can go to Denise and order one from Aprons Diva. I love it. This is so cute. It's got tomatoes and garlic, and um, I think that's, and I'm not sure which herb that is, but that's an, oh, that's an olive branch and then a little olive and mushrooms. So fun, I love it. So it's kind of Italian. This one is a little Italian themed apron. I think that's so cute and I can't wait to use it and I'll use it tonight. But I love the idea also of using it as your little collection basket, okay? So get yourself an apron 
and I highly recommend Denise's aprons because they're so well made, sturdy. If you could feel this material, it's like it's almost like a canvas, you know, like um, I don't know what it's called, um, sailcloth almost. You know what? A good, strong, sturdy apron, this particular one. So I recommend that you get one from Apron Diva, my friend, Denise Jordan. Okay. All right, so let's talk about keeping your plan, making a plan and keeping a plan. So when you plan, if you fail to plan, you're planning to fail. You know that. I know that. Um, I, too, fall down. You know, we all do that. We take... We take such advantage of ourselves, thinking that we can remember because the rest of the world may seem to be able to remember, but I can't remember. I get confused. And it's not like I'm not smart. I'm very smart, but I just forget things. And that's why most of you have a lot of clutter around because you don't have a plan and you think, well, I don't want to forget, so you leave things out. So stop doing that and use your planner. Put things in your planner. So today in our planner, um, and when I'm making this video, today is Tuesday, uh, today is Wednesday. Let me turn to the actual day. Hold on. Today is Wednesday. And um, my plan for the day was to do to check my planner, to do my morning routines. If I have laundry to do it, I don't have any laundry, so I don't have to do that today to check and answer comments, because I'm including my work, it's part of my day, to record some videos for you, which I'm doing one right now, to check my email and social media. So that's the things I wanna get done before lunchtime. And most of those things have been done. For my zone, which I also like to do before lunchtime, uh, it's vacuum the stairs on my in my entryway here. So those are hard to do, vacuum the stairs, because that's a really well-used area. When you live in an RV, they get dirty, and I have carpet, so I, I really work hard to get those nice and clean. Actually, I did that yesterday. Today I'm using it as a free day, but normally Tuesday is your free day. But today is my free day. And then this afternoon, I'm going to make dinner. I already know what I'm having for dinner. We're having black beans and quinoa, and my husband's going to have sweet potato with that. And then, I may have a sweet potato too. And then spend time with Mr. B, watch an hour of YouTube, my evening routines, part A and B, and then review my planner again. So these are the things that are in my plan. The other thing I wanna to do today is I wanna do my nails. I have been a little growing out my nails, um, and I, it's, I'm ready to put some polish on them. I've been growing them out from damage of having artificial nails put on, even though they were those dip nails that are supposed to be good for your nails. My nails are very thin, so they're they're almost all the way grown out, so I'm gonna go ahead and polish them because today is September 1st. It's for me the first day of a new season. You notice I'm wearing a new blouse. I don't know if you noticed that or not, but it's more of a fall look for me. And um, so, yay. I planned on my clothes for today. So you have to plan. If you don't plan, you're gonna mess up. So put on your apron, get out your planner, and follow your plan. Today is a little bit of a work day for you in the house, but when you're done, take off your pretty apron, hang it up for all to see, and make your day a good day without having chemical cleaners or non-chemical cleaners or uh, food splats on your clothes. This will be worn tonight when I make my dinner. I'm very excited about it. Um, I hope that you have a plan, that you have a meal in place, that you're going to do things with your children. That's another thing I want you to plan. Your children are normal kids when they start acting out when you don't give them attention. Kids need attention. They don't need specific things for you to do. They just need attention. They just want to be near you like a little duck following her, the mother. So make sure you give your children some time. Okay. That's it for today. I hope you have a wonderful day. Plan, don't forget, and aprons on. Have a wonderful day, and always remember that you are beautiful. So be beautiful.